Okay, let me give you guys some more practice. So given this, um, well, you, you've got one fraction here divided by another. So um, simplify this. Re re remember that when, when you have A over B divided by C over D, um, this thing here stays the same. So it will be A, B, and then you times the reciprocal of the second fraction. So it will be, uh, so r r rather than doing this, you would do this. Okay, so, so top times top, bottom times bottom. Well, anyway, do whatever you have to do. Um, simplify this. Okay, press pause and have a go. Okay, so rather than doing the divide, we, we're going to keep this the same, but then multiply the reciprocal of this. Okay, so, um, so hang on. So keep this the same, x minus 3 over x squared, but then we times the reciprocal. So it, it will be this, um, x squared minus nine okay um and then and then uh, you should be able to spot that well uh, this thing here can easily square root and this thing can easily square root and there's a minus in between so so let so factorize factorize this part here so uh hang on so it would be x minus three over x squared uh times uh x and then and then uh, you, you, you got to, so at, at the moment we've got this, hang on, at the moment we've got this, uh, let, let, let me write this again, at the moment we've got x squared minus 9, okay, so, so you, you, you can see you can easily square root this and you can easily square root the 9, so just, just jump to this, x um, plus 3 and then, and then immediately x minus 3. Okay, so um, so now it's uh, is top times top, bottom times bottom. So this here, well, you can merge the two fractions now. So so it would be this x bracket x minus three uh, all over uh, uh, x squared, uh, and then you've got x minus uh, sorry x plus three, and then x minus three. Okay. Um, it, so this here would cancel out with uh, with the minus over here, minus three over here. Okay, so so it would then become this um, x over over x squared uh, x plus three. Okay, and now you can divide top and bottom by by uh, by x. Uh, so so this this here would then become well well basically just visualize it as as this now. Um, x and then you've got x times x uh, times x and then you and then um, and then times times this bubble here which is x uh, plus three um, th these these would well well when when you divide top and bottom by x remember this this becomes a one because x uh, x divided by x is one so this actually becomes one over uh, x uh, bracket x plus three. So this here would be your answer. Okay. Next one. So um, yeah, add these two fractions together. Re remember, if if you're given uh, a over b plus c over d, um, just get the two denominators to be the same. So over here you would multiply top and bottom by d. Over here multiply top and bottom by by b, just so that the two denominators uh, can be the same. Well, anyway, press pause and have a go. Okay, so uh, so here, um, yeah, so so on, on this side, we're going to times top and bottom by uh, by this bubble here. So it will be um, times top and bottom by x plus two, times top and bottom here by x plus two, and then over here, you times top and bottom here by by this bubble here. So uh, times top and bottom by by uh, by x uh, plus three, and then uh, and then x plus three. Okay, so so this one here would then become um, x um, bracket uh, x plus two uh, over uh, x plus three, and then uh, and then x plus two, um, and then this here would become well, now it's this times this bubble here, so it would be uh, four four uh, x bracket x plus three, and then here you would have 
um, x plus two, and that that exists in a bubble, and then and then you've got another bubble here. So uh, so it, so this here, hang on, uh, yeah, x plus three. So now that now that the two denominators are the same, we can merge. Okay, so down at the bottom will be x plus three, uh, and then x plus two. Up here it will be well. I, I'm 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 going to multiply multiply at the brackets here. So uh, it would be um, x squared plus two x, uh, and then you've got a plus here, uh, and that now this times this here, which would be um, four x squared, and then this times this here would be would be um, uh, plus plus twelve x. Now. Um, now merge. Well, you've got an elephant here. Oh, you've got an elef one elephant here plus four elephants here. So you're going to have five elephants. And then here you've got your giraffe and your giraffe here. So you can merge them together. Okay. So so this one here would then become. Hang on. Uh, x plus three. Uh, close this off. And then x plus two. And then uh, so so here well, you've got one elephant. Plus five elephant, uh, four elephants, so that will give you five elephants, and then you've got two giraffes, uh, plus uh, twelve giraffes, so that will give you plus um, uh, what, what what is it? Plus um, uh, plus fourteen giraffes, yeah. Okay, so uh, so can you um, can can you factorize the top part now? Um, yeah, well, you can take x out as a factor. So, uh, so you can take x out. So this will become five uh, x uh, plus fourteen. Okay, over uh, now over over x plus three, and then uh, and then x plus two. Okay, so so this here would be your final answer. Okay.